Today we're at the Park Canyon Ghost Town. It was established in 1865. It began as a very small operation and grew in size over the years. The population did fluctuate over the years it was active. Sometimes it was a, uh, it had a high population, high employment, and other times low employment and low population. It was really inconsistent. Although, after all this inconsistency with its population, it was finally abandoned in 1916. What we're looking at right now is the mill, which is a very impressive mill. Considering how old this place is, over 100 years old, it's amazing to see the rock walls of the mill still remaining. Now a lot of the houses and whatnot at this ghost town, they don't really remain anymore. It's really just ruins. You might see maybe where a fireplace would be, but that's about it, or a couple stone walls. So we're not going to spend too much time in the town itself, but after we look at this mill, we're going to go up the canyon and check out the mining operations. So we have quite a lot to check out in today's video. So let's go inside this mill. Starting at the lowest level. Absolutely massive. This was a huge mill. You could just imagine how busy it was in its active years. Windows all around. We just have these massive rock walls. Which it's amazing that they're still standing. Looking in through the window. This is the bottom level we just looked at. Then as we continue. That's a massive wall right there. Still at the bottom level. There's no stairs or anything left behind. That's why I'm going outside of the building to get to the upper levels. And this is the second level looking up. Hopefully there's a window that we could go through. I did make it to the second level. Went through the window. Then we have a third level up there to check out. So I'll just quickly look at the second level because there's not very much to see in this level. It does give us a great view of the lower level. And looking up, just at all this rock work. Climbing even further up. Looking out the window. So I'm coming up to the third level right now. Going through, would have had a massive entryway right there. Maybe to bring equipment in, whatnot like that. And then we're up on the third level. What a view. Just looking around us, let's do a quick 360. Climbed up from over there. And then 
going out of this appears we had an entryway right there bunch of trash why would they dump all their stuff out here have batteries, clothing, all kinds of stuff. Fender for a bike, motorbike. And looking this way, this is really bizarre. This definitely wasn't dumped on purpose. Maybe someone had a bad breakup or something. Like, why would they dump all over tools? All stuff that's worth a lot of money. Already know it. Like, this is bizarre. A couple other tools in there. Have a tarp. And this way we have an ATV ramp, which alone that's worth quite a bit of money. Actually, this is one of those where you hook it up to your tailgate your hitch and then you shove a bike on it and then a tent got a tire right here worth a little bit of money why would they dump all their crap out here and you know any time now someone's going to come by and steal all this it's only a matter of time especially those tools Decided to keep their aloe vera water all still closed. What do you think is the reason for this being left? I'm now going to continue going way up the canyon because we have some mine ruins to check out. So let's get going. We have the mill in the distance and I found a rock foundation. Figured why not have a quick look. This is interesting. This is one of the chimneys for the houses. Unfortunately, the house itself doesn't remain. We do have a chimney though. Making my way up this very steep and narrow canyon road. Going up this way, I am going to continue driving because we do have some mines up there I want to check out soon. Although I stopped because we officially hit the first mining operation. This whole thing almost looks like an open pit. Like they just dynamited it. Beginning with, we have this, what looks almost like a, an old portal. That's been filled in, or collapsed in, I shouldn't say filled in. Because this is so desolate, it's not like they'd close off any of the mines up here. And then we have waste rock in the distance. And a dump truck bed. Really what I wanted to check out at this site 
is right up ahead. It's that cabin right on the cliff. Let's go check it out. I have arrived at the stone house, which was apparently more of an expedition than I thought. I couldn't walk up this because that's all cliff. So I had to walk around. All that's plant life right there. I had to walk around that and go up, 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 and then down from there. But we've arrived. Looking up on top of it, it's just all this rock. Just tons and tons of rock. So we have the chimney right there, the fireplace, and then had the pipe going out right there. The craziest thing about this house, really the reason I wanted to come up here, is just to see where it's located. This cliff is just eroding into it. I'm trying to safely continue walking towards this cliff without stepping on a, any unstable rock. All this has just eroded. Taking this house slowly, a little bit at a time. Now let's climb back down and continue going up this road. We have a couple more miles until we get to the next operation. Currently on the top of a mountain and I hate to say it, but I think I need to admit defeat. Looking around, looking at all those mountains right there, they're definitely not passable to get down into this canyon. And this is a straight up cliff, what we're at right now. It would not be safe to go down this way. I don't think we're making it today. The mine we're trying to get to is in the distance over there. Something else I noticed is a workshop, right? Let me zoom in. A workshop or a cabin right there. So it's in a totally separate canyon. That's something I didn't notice on Google Maps. I thought it was just at the top of this one, but it turns out I'd have to hike all the way down, down into that canyon, which I cannot safely do from where I'm at right now. So, another day, another time. It's getting late, it's about six o'clock, so I should be getting going. Maybe a few years from now, a few months, who knows, whenever I get the chance. We'll come back in try and do this one which this was a totally separate mining operation by the way but i kind of wanted to merge these two into one video but it's just not going to happen just look how steep that is too it's insane so thank you for watching be sure to subscribe i hope you enjoyed the video someday we'll come back and tackle this other canyon the canyon we're in where my vehicle is parked is right there can you see it? Little green vehicle that's a little bit blending in with the trees. That's where I'm parked. So we've seen all of this canyon right there. That's great. Now we just have this one to check out someday. So thank you for watching. I'm going to hike back down. This is it today.